Kenya Airport Authority advised passengers using JKIA to arrive early to the airport to avoid potential delays in catching their flights due to heightened security. The security was heightened due to threats by Gen Zs to occupy JKIA during their Tuesday demonstration. You see, for weeks it has been rumored that JKIA is being auctioned to Adana and the Kenya Airport Authority Board Chairperson Caleb is overseeing the process. Allegations were that former CS for road and transportation will come in the final stages of leasing the airport for 30 years to a corrupt company in India and has received massive kickbacks. In fact, the company that more recommend uh, received kickback was called Holuba Abu Dhabi in UAE. The deal was done without public participation. Rumor has it that the incoming CS for road and transportation, Mr. Churchill, has been put there to ensure that Murkomen's deal with Adani Group on the JKIA takeover is done. The acting inspector general Douglas Kanja says that Kenyans are not allowed to protest in protected areas such as JKIA. By the way, President William Ruto has made six media coordination meeting in the African Union in Ghana and as well three trips within Africa, two trips to Europe and one trip to the United States due to the ongoing nationwide protests. Afro Cinema continues.